Hello everyone, welcome to Mike Muses Megazords. Today's video is issue 64 of the Altair Megazord build and we're going to be starting work on the back legs of the Sabretooth Tiger. So, let's do a parts check, uh, make sure everything's there and then we'll get right into it. So, parts list starts with 64-1, which is going to be the left-hand side of the leg. 64-2 is the right-hand side. 64-3, top of the paw. 64-4 is going to be the pivot point on the paw. 64.5 is the bottom of the paw, and then we've got two lots of hardware. <coughs> so the first one is a couple of silicon O-rings, which are being extremely shy. There's one, and there's two. Then we've got our pivot point for the paw. And then our hardware pack is four 2x5mm uh, screws, which are these short ones, one, two, three, four. And then two of the 2x3x6mm slightly longer screws. So, parts are all there, good stuff. <coughs> Get rid of the packaging. And let's make a start. So, over the page we go, and the first part we're going to do is be making the foot sub-assembly. So, what we're going to do is take the top of the paw, flip it upside down, then we're going to take this connecting piece and put that into place here. Then we've got the bottom of the paw, we'll go here. And that will be secured with 62.8, which was one of the smaller of the screws. We will drop a little screw in there. Just make sure that's all good to go. And that is our sub-assembly here done. So we'll put that down, move on. Section B. We're going to be taking, which one's that? That is 64.1, so the left hand side of the leg. And in there, we are going to be putting our friction point, our pivot point, sorry. And again, we need this to be facing vertically. And then that should just drop straight in here. With a little bit of wiggling. So it actually cover it's the hole on this side, which you need to line that up so that the bolt will come straight through. And I'll just use a little bit of pressure on the desktop. There we go. So that's in, flush. Done. So I flip this round, <coughs> and now we'll take our poor sub-assembly. So these two holes are where the wheels will go on the back leg of um, Sabretooth Tiger. So the paw will need to face away from them. And before you do that, you need to drop one of these silicon O-rings on here. And we'll drop, clamp that in place, flip it over. And 64A is another one of these machine screws here. We'll drop that into place. And make sure that's firmly tightened, like so. So you've still got movement on there. And then what we'll do is we'll flip this over. And we will uh, do exactly the same thing with 64.2. So 
let's put that silicone o-ring there drop that into place line up this section here and secure that in place with another one of the 64.8 smaller machine screws like so and there we have it <clears throat> that's the back leg done and the last thing we want to do is take one of our larger machine screws and secure both of these two uh, leg sections together in this point here like so so nice quick video today not a lot of assembly work to do but we are making progress bit by bit so thank you very much for watching that concludes issue 64 of the Altai Megazord build thank you very much for watching it's always appreciated if you want to drop a comment in the comments box below if you want to talk about anything you've seen in the video don't forget to like and subscribe if you're just joining us and we'll see you next time for issue 65 of the Altai Megazord build Thanks for watching. Bye for now.